It is fascinating how children learn and fascinating how we learn. Welcome back to Talking With Jazz with your host, Big Daddy O. I hope you're enjoying this season. I know it was much anticipated. I had to take a break. I discussed that in a previous episode, so I'm not going to discuss it now. I want to move on. I want to talk about the fucking moon. Now, I know you're going to... Yeah, I normally don't swear, at least beyond shit. Like, that's kind of my limit. But today, I have to use the fucking word, okay? I'm going to let it out. (laughs) Feels good, right? Because it's in context. The fucking moon. This is one of my favorite stories, to be totally honest. Because my son, when he was a little baby, we had trouble getting him to bed. So one of the things we did was to hold him up against the window and point up at the moon and say, look at the moon. Doesn't it make you feel tired? Sure it makes me feel tired. You know, that sort of thing. It was kind of some sort of meant to be like relaxing. We're trying to do the right thing. You know, relax before bedtime. Not play one of Dad's silly games, you know, where everyone gets amped up and it all ends ends up in tears. But anyway, this was sort of like, you know, look at the moon. Look at the pretty moon, isn't it cool? You know, I'd I'd have to work out where it would be, so I'd look out. We'd point at it, and then he would sort of point and go, moon, moon, that sort of thing. Anyway. At the time, I had a small office in my house, and I had one employee, and her name was Lucy. She later changed her name to Lucian. Anyway, one day, my son came to the office door and noticed that it was a daytime moon. You know, I don't know why it does that, but sometimes a daytime moon happens. Some reason to do with shadows and so on and the lack of sun. You know, you can think about it and it would actually work out. But anyway, so he starts looking up and pointing and trying to indicate to me whilst I'm trying to concentrate on what's going on. And he's going, look, Dad, the moon, the moon. And my worker, who should have stayed concentrated on what she was doing, turned around and said, What is it with the fucking moon? And so I explained to her the whole thing about getting him to sleep by relaxing and looking at the moon and all that. Anyway, from that moment onwards, every time we saw the moon, my son, a three-year-old, would say, Look at the fucking moon. Dad, it's the fucking moon. It was a little bit embarrassing. I don't think anyone noticed, but, you know, the story lives on. So why don't you just have a great day? Hi. I hope you're enjoying the new series. I'm really trying to get it right. And now it's your turn to get it right. You see, I don't want to pollute my other outlets with uh, my random thoughts. So I've moved this uh, channel, this uh, mindless random thoughts channel, the Big Daddy O character and all the fun and all the hilarity, off to the YouTube channel because, well, It's pure there. And there's no politics anymore. I don't have to talk about local issues or anything like that. I'm free to explore the future and the past. So, make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel. Make sure you hit the bell, the like button, make a comment. Tell me to go get lost. You have to interact. It actually will build and we'll have something to talk about. Even if I end up pillorying you in the future. No, I won't do that. I won't. Just 
just have a great day.